Hello, YouTube. This is Galactic God, and uh, we just got a full case of the new Yu-Gi-Oh! set, Storm of Ragnarok. Alright, that's right. Time to record a new Yu-Gi-Oh! video. Let me get some music going. Oh, yeah. That gets me pumped. That gets me in the spirit. Time to do it. Time to make a crap. To get the king of games himself, the Pharaoh, to come onto my channel and do a very special interview. Thank you, thank you, Pharaoh, for, for coming onto my channel and for agreeing to do this interview with me. All right, so here we are with our test subject. Are you ready to learn how to play Yu-Gi-Oh? All right, awesome. See, I have friends that also know that I can make any kind of deck I want at any time. And when they come over to my house, they're very fascinated by this. And they like to throw all my cards out and take a look at them. And well, we're not we're not actually gonna duel, Pharaoh. I mean, this, this is an interview, not a duel. But that's where you're wrong. No, I, I, don't, I don't think I'm... Okay, you got that so far, right? Okay, moving on. All right, introduce yourself. Guys, Slim X, Team Symmetry, I guess. Symmetry? Symmetry? Yep. Slim. I need to go by Slim. Black to God. Do you know her? She's on social right now. Take a gene. Find yourself. Am I a Since you don't even know me? I do know you. I've never seen you in person. Simply unlucky. 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 Sim Previously on Cyber Knight 8610's channel. Yeah, I know you guys really enjoy pack openings and everything, so we've come up with a great new idea. How about a pack opening challenge? So glad to God, I'm gonna challenge him to open up one of the new Heretic Dragon tins. I challenge him to open up one of those tins, and we're gonna see who gets the better hollows out of those. Now this looks like a challenge I'm gonna have to accept. Now some of you might have noticed that I buy a gargantuan amount of tin cases, boxes, packs, and all that kind of stuff. So we're gonna go ahead and bust right into this. Uh, we're gonna open up a, quite a few of these. Oh, wait, maybe more than just a little bit more. Oh, waves and waves of them doing. Um, here it is right here. This is, of course, that I've been looking forward to getting. There's a lot of really good, great new cards in it. The case comes with 12 of them. So we have a uh, set, that's right, 12 full boxes in all. All day long I've been moving and I stopped in the middle of it to run down and pick up this. The brand new Yu-Gi-Oh set, Return of the Duelist. There we have it, Photon Shockwave. Boxes and boxes and boxes of them right here. Big. All right. And I get, oh my god. Upside down even. It doesn't want to, it's stuck for me. Oh, <laughs> oh, it. oh my gosh! <laughs> I don't believe it. They're all messed up. And boom! Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, nice. This is an awesome box right here. And Whoa. oh, dang. I quit. Today I'm bringing you a Yu-Gi-Oh! Anonymous meeting. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I'm gonna take oh my god! No. <laughs> K.O. Also, don't forget to subscribe to the one and only Galactic God. What is with all that cosmic stuff in your background? What? What? What are you, what are you talking about? What? What cosmic stuff? It's never heard of this. You've never heard of the Morale Boost OTK? No, no, you gotta okay. explain it to me. Morale Boost OTK involves like 15 cards, so it's not really an OTK. <laughs> the fuck kind of OTK involves 15 cards? It's stupid, it's the most situational thing in the- I was so filled with joy, I still had my Goyo Guardian. Hello, I am Asian Eyes White Dragon, and I play Yuki.
Disney, that's probably gonna do it for this movie. It's back. Does everyone see that? Anyways, I just want to say thank you very much for coming on to my channel and doing this interview with me. I, I really do appreciate it. Until next time. Until, until next time what? It's time to do. Okay, yeah. All right, time. Time to go. I walk right into that. Okay, so you're all set and ready to play Yu-Gi-Oh, right? What's up, YouTube? This is Galactic God, and welcome to my 1,000th YouTube video. Now, I'm gonna keep this uh, kind of short and sweet. Uh, I'm still feeling a little under the weather, as a lot of you guys might have noticed from a lot of my recent videos. I, I am a little ill at the moment, but uh, I, I, I press on and I continue to, to make YouTube videos, but it's, it's pretty crazy to think that, you know, that I've actually made a thousand of these things. I mean, uh, when I was putting together the little montage at the beginning, I was going through a lot of my really old videos and I was looking back at them and I was, I was looking at old uh, deck profiles that I did and the, looking at how horrible the lighting was in those. I mean, you can't even really tell what some of the cards are. And some of the vlog type videos where I'm sitting there talking in front of the camera, I'm like so shadowy. I was like, I was like, where, where is the light at? Why don't I have more lighting going on? And just really the overall video production quality was was quite awful. And not only was it just the lighting that was horrible, but the video quality was so bad. And uh, you know, it's hard to think that anyone would watch those videos, let alone subscribe to me based off of them. And uh, it's kind of humbling really to see where one comes from and uh, it gives me great pride to, to see how far I've come and and really uh, you know it's it's been an incredible journey uh, about learning how to to make videos here on YouTube and to present them to you guys and a lot of trial and error a lot of error <laughs> and uh, I just want to say thank you to everyone who's come along uh, this journey with me especially those of you who have been with me for a very long time uh, way, way back from the beginning. People like Programmer X, who I know has been watching my videos from back in the dark, dark ages, if you will, where so much of the quality I think of as being not very good. Um, but it's really just, you know, a, a learning process. And I feel like I've learned a lot, not only about, you know, making videos and posting them on YouTube, but I feel like I've learned a lot about the game as well. Whenever you make videos, you know, you tend to do a lot of research into it and you you get more involved in Yu-Gi-Oh! as a whole. And although, you know, I've played Yu-Gi-Oh! for years and loved the game, it wasn't until I really started making YouTube videos uh, that I kind of developed uh, an even bigger, deeper passion for it. And uh, it's, you know, become an even bigger part of my life. And, you know, and a lot of that has to do with, with YouTube, with you guys out there who, uh, you know, come with me along for this crazy ride on uh, my YouTube channel. And uh, it's been a blast. It's been fun. I enjoy making uh, YouTube videos very much. And I just want to say thank you guys for uh, watching the content that I produce and subscribing to me and commenting on my videos and sending me messages either through YouTube or Facebook or whatever. Uh, I mean, I just love sitting around talking about the game with people who, you know, have as much passion for it as I do. And really that's that's all I'm going to say for uh this video is I just want to end it with a, a definitely a heartfelt thank you from me to you guys. I really do appreciate uh, you know, everything that you bring with you. And uh I guess that's that's really it. So, for my 1,000th video, this is Galactic God, out.